Okay. So there is the Gerald. He's got his own bit of krill. This guy, he is also, you can't really see it very well, but trust me, he's got some. The Halloween Hermit Crab did actually accept the krill. Um, I'm not sure why he wouldn't take the blood worms, but there is then this guy who I, he was chilling at the back a bit. Um, I did kind of pick him up and just put him where I could actually offer him food properly. Um, obviously, Saucy Backer is, um, I didn't want to give him food because he was still changing his shell. Um, I kind of moved some of the shells away from the porcelain and enemy crab because it kind of looked like he was a bit stuck. But... He's now, you know, <laughs> doing stuff. I'm not sure why Gerald has decided to eat his food upside down, but he's more than welcome to, I guess. <laughs> I'm not really sure. Um, but yeah, there's four crabs happily munching away we are uh, I think in the what week maybe in the not very big amount of time that I have had these I'm fairly sure they've eaten more krill than the actual um, Ewan and unnamed crab number two put together um, in the entirety of their lives. Um, but yeah, I'm not sure. Um, I'll have a quick look to see if there's any special way you're meant to feed anemones. I don't really know. All the corals, I'm not really sure, to be honest. Um, Gerald has flipped himself back the right way up again. But yeah, there we go, there's, there's the crabs, all nice and fed. 